How is everybody doing? I may need to adjust the uh, the sound settings again. Damn. What? What? Damn. Killing them, Reese. Okay. We gotta look for... Where are we even looking? I don't even remember where we're looking. Well, you kick ass, Reese. Um, what's my current objective? I thought I was supposed to be on the third floor. Or the second floor. Um, Reese, where am I supposed to be? Am I supposed to be on the second floor? By the way, I haven't even opened that card yet. I didn't have any time. Is it the nurse's up? <laughs> that strange cry. That had to be Celeste. It came from the floor above. She's on the third floor. I sprint up to the floor. What? Everyone. Over here, everyone. Everyone who heard the scream had come running. Just a second. Celeste, what's wrong? What? That was a rather intense scream for someone like you. <laughs> I saw him. That strange costume man. He ran off as soon as I screamed. I was blocking the stairs, so he headed further down into the hallway and disappeared. He must be down this hall. Come on, let's go. Ha <laughs> ah, ha! Ah. You better not kill uh, Reese's waifu. Why is this game doing this all of a sudden? Huh? Whoa, it's really true. But that doesn't matter right now. No! Uh, fucking, huh? huh? What What was that? Oh, it came from downstairs. It must have been Kafumi. He's in the nurse's office. This is bad. Come on, we have to go back. What? What about the suspect? We're all down in this. To, we've gone to all this trouble to capture him, right? Hmm. Then why don't we split into two groups? It's all clear now. I'll lead the hunting party. That seems much more interesting. So then... Is the audio okay again? Because, again, I mess with it every day. Very well, then. Makoto, uh, I'll leave the capture of the suspicious individual to Toko Sakura and Baiku Bayakuya. So then. We'll handle it. Just go take care of Hifumi. Okay, you guys be careful. With that, we split into two groups. Me, Celeste, and Hina all ran downstairs to the first floor. Just a second. He's in the nurse's office. Let's go. We stormed in the nurse's office, and what greeted us was a world of dripping crimson. <gasps> Someone killed a Fumi? Yes! Okay, here. Let us turn this up. Oh, okay, that's no! too much. Pog. What the? Fumi just died. We're good. Okay. Is that better? Is that better? Oh, la, 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 la. <laughs> Would be murdered. No. No way. You're not serious, are you? He's not really dead, is he? has been discovered after a certain amount of time which you may use however you like the class trial will be well i didn't remember that like i don't know yeah okay what okay. the that was the body discovery announcement the body discovery announcement the when three or more people discover a body after murder that's what plays and since we just heard it that means <sighs> it must mean hafumi Someone killed him. One of us. What's up, Pog? I thought I said hi to you. I was dealing with everything, though. When Celeste said that, she pointed to something. Why is my... Okay. Why does my thing keep uh, auto-passing fucking text? Auto mode. I want auto mode off. Okay, that's what it was. 
Something that had also been on the floor after the last two surprise attacks. Oh, I'm not saying I did. I, I'm I'm multitasking I'm like shit. Pug, how's are you doing, buddy? Another hammer. Justice Hammer 3. I mean, Hafumi did suck a lot. It's even bigger than the other two. Just as I suspected. One strike from that and you are finished. Then the killer. There can be no doubt. The suspicious individual. It's good to see you, Pug. Going by what Hafumi called him. The culprit must be Robo Justice. Whoever's hiding that costume is the one that killed Hafumi. But wait. You saw him on the third floor, right? Running back into the hall. How, so how did he end up in the nurse's office? You're not saying they, like, teleported or something, right? Are you okay with this? We can figure that part out later. Right now we have to tell the others. Yeah, you're right. So then, then shall we go? <sighs> Hina, snap out of it. Huh? huh? Are you okay, Hina? Sorry. So sorry. I'm not sure I can move right now. I, I'm feeling kind of, hmm. this is a problem. We can't just leave Hina here alone. Okay, then I'll go get everyone. You stay here with Hina. <sighs> Very well. I'll leave it to you then. Okay, I'll be back soon. I tried to sound confident and upbeat, but I still hadn't stopped trembling from what I'd been through. Everyone else is already on the full third floor. I have to hurry. This is where everyone was chasing after the suspicious individual. Where was he headed? Celeste, what's wrong? That was a rather intense scream for someone like you. I saw him, the strange costume man. He ran off as soon as I screamed. I was blocking the stairs, so he headed back further down into the hallway and disappeared. He ran off, going further down the hallway, way into the back of the hallway. Okay, we got to go to the physics room. How's your day, Pug? How was everybody's day, you lovely people? As far as I can tell, there's nobody here. But still, I could I feel some kind of presence. Yeah, I'm sure I could feel somebody someone's presence. This presence. It's coming from over there. In the back. I feel you on that one. Astros! I leapt through the doorway, and when I did I found another nightmare. The second nightmare of the day was waiting there to greet me. Well, at least it was him. There, in a pool of his own blood, was Taka, dead. That's double kills. Double rainbow all the way. Danganronpa. Ifumi's body discovered in the nurse's office. Taka's body discovered in the equipment room. I was witness to two nightmares, one right after another. Astros, how you doing, buddy? No, they weren't nightmares. This is harsh reality. The true nightmare is this reality, the, the reality I have to face every day. Exactly, Pug. I'm doing good, man, but still. Why is this happening? Shit. Another hammer. Now it's just as hammer four, and it's even bigger than before. Is that suspicious individual responsible for killing Taka, too? Well. Taka. Damn it. Why did this happen? What am I supposed to be... T Toko? Don't tell me. Toko, too. Hmm. No, she's just passed out. Relax. She just passed out when she saw the blood. The blood? 
Oh, that's right. When Toko is um, Toko, she has a fear of blood, huh? <laughs> We've tried everything to get her to wake up, but no luck. Just leave her for now. It's like he said. I should just leave her alone for now. However. But why is it Justice Hammer 4? Huh? What do you mean? Hmm. Celeste was, was attacked with Justice Hammer 1, and Hifumi was hit with Justice Hammer 2. But this time it was Justice Hammer 4. What happened to number 3? Ah. What? What's the matter? Well, when you mentioned Justice Hammer 3, you just reminded me. What? Out with it. Do you know something? Actually, Taka's not the only one that's been killed. Hifumi's dead, too. What? What? Hey! Hifumi's been killed? Y yeah. I see. Which is why you came to get us. Then we better go check it out. Damn. Of course. Come on. They're going to leave the body? So, so Sakura, Bayakuya, and I rush out of the physics lab. But as soon as we are the physics lab. Oh. Ah. Celeste, aren't you supposed to be waiting in the nurse's office? Oh, good. So something has come up. Hm. Yeah, I heard. Fumi is dead, right? Indeed. Well, that is not all. It is gone. Huh? What's gone? It has disappeared. Disappeared? Oh, good. Fumi's body has disappeared. What? What, what, did what you are you say? talking about? It disappeared? Don't be ridiculous. Come on. Are you serious? What? What the heck is happening here? Hey! Everyone, back to the nurse's office. I practically leapt down the stairs, nearly losing my balance. I reached the nurse's office completely out of breath. I couldn't believe my eyes. Who could move his fat ass? Hufumi's body was there just a few minutes earlier. It just disappeared. Me and Celeste went to the bathroom, but we were only gone for like a minute. And then when we got back, Indeed. this must be work of the culprit. They must have come and carried the body away. They must really be enjoying this, enjoying the sight of us standing around, frightened and confused. Okay. I, yeah, I think he has too, Pug. I think he's the one who killed Taka. We're all going to die here. We're going to die just like those guys died. What? what I don't believe say? this. I don't believe a body would just disappear. Why? First, there were two murders, and now one of the bodies has been taken. This is unnatural. Huh? Uh, hold on. What do you mean, two murders? Hina. Taka's been killed. We found him in the equipment room. No way! It, it can't be. Taka, too? It can't be. It can't be. No! No! Hina. Hina, calm down. We're all going to die. All of us. They're going to kill us. All of us. <laughs> then who might... The next target be Toko? Huh? What? I completely forgot. She's still unconscious in the equipment room. Well. You left her at the scene of the crime? <laughs> Mickey! What's up, friend? I don't... She's not... She's been missing for this whole, like, chapter. We don't have a choice. She passed out and she refused to wake up. Huh? So she's still unconscious? Damn. How you doing, Mickey? Wait, so you know who... You knew she was still up there and said nothing? Why? <laughs> That's annoying. That annoying little insect that clings to me wherever I go. We'd be better off without her. Bastard! You, you bastard! <laughs> Calm down. You forgot about her, didn't you? You have no right to blame me. Everyone stop fighting. Right now, we need to hurry back. Huh? This a... Well, I tracked down a video card that I don't know if I'm going to keep because it's so much goddamn money. I can't take this anymore. I don't want anyone else to die. Damn. I see that, Vissy. Hello. Yep. Bayakuya, if something's happened to Toko, I'll never forgive you. <laughs> Vissy's a ninja. We shot out of the nurse's office and bolted up, to the, up the stairs, heading back to the third floor. Hey, friend. We ran back to the equipment room at full speed. And when we got there... Toko! And we're missing another body. Thank God you're okay. Right? But right away I noticed there was something very different here. It was gone. Taka's body, which should have been right there, had disappeared. 
I found it. I went to Micro Center today in the middle of the day and found it at 3090. This can't be happening. Are we loosening all this or something? She uh, she put points into the Rod Cosplay Challenge. No, it's not a hallucination. I know I saw it before. But what I'm seeing now isn't what I saw before. Huh? What? What? Are you saying Taka disappeared too? Stop talking. There's not one in your in all of Denmark. Jesus Christ, man. Stop saying disappeared. Didn't just vanish into thin air. Obviously, whoever did this has hidden the body. That's not fun. That's why I bought a 3090, Mickey, because it was like, I can't get a 3080. But why would they do that? I couldn't possibly begin to imagine. Anyway, our costume suspect is clearly like, continuing his crime spree. We gotta hurry up and catch him before he kills all of us. Not possible. Oh, it's it's insane, Mickey. Oh, and I don't think you have to worry about that. Huh? Huh? Hm. Think about it. Who could possibly be responsible for killing and hiding these dead bodies? Well. Um. Hmm. When Hifumi's death cry went up, everyone here was together on the third floor. It is so. After that, we split up into two groups. Hmm. And now, this time, you all came here as a group from the nurse's office. In other words, the only ones who could have done this are Hiro and Ka Kayoki, Kayoko, who are still missing. H hold on a second. Kaiko has an alibi for when Celeste and Hifumi were attacked. There's no question that she was in the dining hall with us. Hmm. Well, yeah, because Mickey, if their if their cards couldn't do that, then their demand would be way less. <laughs> you seem very adamant about defending her. She's Reese's waifu. We have to defend her. Perhaps you are in love. That that's not it at all. That's fine. Well, anyways, yeah, I do accept Ke Kyoko's alibi, Let's which see. means the suspicious individual we're looking for can be none other than Hiro. Hmm. Which further means there will be no more murders. The regulations are very clear about that. Oh, that's right. There's a rule that says you can only kill a maximum of two people. That's right. As long as that rule is in place, there will be. There will not be a third murder. If they were to break that rule, I'd mince ya. Mince ya without a second thought. Mince ya. Grind ya. Turn ya into paste. By the way, did you know that fish paste can also refer, refer to shellfish, like shrimp or crabs? Hmm. Indeed. Let's LZT, what's up, buddy? So since two people have been killed, there's n n no possibility of any more. Perhaps. You knew that from the beginning, didn't you, Bayakuya? Which means you knew Toko was never in danger. I still meant it when I said we'd be better off without her, though. In other words... What's up, LZT, you sexy boy, you? Anyway, with that in mind, we can now relax and search for the two missing bodies. The two missing bodies. Who could find fucking fat asses... Who could move fat asses' body? Two people have been killed, and their bodies have been hidden. The only one without an alibi, the only one who could have done it, is... Hero. But. Reese! Pug! Pug Ugly, thank you so much for a gift of sub to that nerd, Reese. That mastermind, Reese. That one who's behind everything, Reese. Pug Ugly, thank you for the continued support. Reese, welcome back to the Empire Rod. Oh, hail Gizmo! <laughs> Damn sea otters. <laughs> but is he really the killer? What about Kyoko? All hail Gizmo. If she's not involved in this case, where did she go? What? Hey, Makoto, what's the matter? Huh? Oh, no. It's nothing. Hm. Whatever. We need to find those bodies, or our little narrative here can't move forward. So Very then. well. Then let's split up and begin searching. But. But, but. There's no need to be afraid. No more murders will take place during this case. Cause I, I, I know that. I mean, I think I do, but Hina. if you're still nervous, I'll come with you. Huh? Uh, okay, thank you. Mm. No need to thank me. <laughs> then let's get moving. Yell out if you find anything. 
Bayukuya left the equipment room, followed by the others. Like, how could you hear someone on the third floor of this building? I have to try and find the two missing bodies. Jesus Christ. Where are we going to stick bodies? Let's be real here. I guess we just start looking in rooms. Oh, hail Gizmo. We need to search for the bodies that have disappeared. What happens after that? I mean... Huh? The door must be locked. Well, how do we... Unlock it? Because that's a problem. There are, there are paintings lining the walls. I don't see anything out of the ordinary about them. Man, we have... DM, DMC <laughs> the F DMCA, the FCC, or Sea Otters. No, that I mean, if we know what happens because of South Park, the so that that otters take over the world in the end. So we all know that. And when you went on a Nintendo Wii, how are we supposed to get into this room then? I love I love LZT's line of reasoning. It's perfect. It's like the perfect series of events. So you go. Yeah, I am. I'm trying another room. Why is it locked though? What the what the heck is with this thing? Okay. We're gonna go this way. Like, can you really move the fatty's body all around the building? I don't like it. I don't know. Nothing in here. With, it looks like Monokuma jizzing in his own face, but like, what is this? It really, it makes me question life right now. Ah, Makoto. Come on. Why are you just standing there? We need to get to the repository. Huh? You mean? Indeed. I found them. I don't know, Pug. Hafumi and Taka's bodies have had both been hidden in the repository. Goodbye. I've already told Hina and Sakura. We'll go on ahead. Their bodies were in the repository? I'm going the wrong way. Hey. It's a wonderful emote, Vicky. Okay, Astros, love your face. Have a good dinner, dude. Have a good dinner! I had some chicken and cauliflower for dinner. What's the repository? What the fuck is the repository? What the fuck is the repository? Why did I think it was the physics room? Oh, the place in the art room? Are the bodies here somewhere? I guess it's unlocked. Then I have no choice but to go inside. I know it was books, but I didn't know where. And when I entered, I saw 